Hi, Ted. We're three games into the preseason. Uh, dress rehearsal out of the way. Browns have not looked good. They've made some more roster moves, uh, dropped a couple more veterans, Paul Kruger and that. A lot of fans are getting worried. That, is this maybe the worst Browns team we've ever seen? Well, that was an email I read right before we came over here. That was followed up by the other days. Is the Browns will have the worst defense ever. Right. Very simple question. How many games did they win last year? Three. Okay. So you're, the baseline is? Not very high. Three. Okay. <laughs> right. So I think that's part of the reason when they sit there and go, Paul Kruger, is he a little bit better than Nate Orchard or not? Right. They won how many games? Three. So they rather would say, let's let Kruger go. Let's see what Nate Orchard can do. Emmanuel Ogba can do. Somebody else. By the way, a guy who's rising up a little bit, Joe Schobert the right. fourth rounder from Wisconsin. I think that's part of the reason they cut a Kruber. I heard Schobert looked pretty good on tape. I didn't see the tape, but that's what I was told. Right. But, Mike, you were right. I was in Tampa. I watched it. The only thing I could say is, I was in Tampa last year for the third game. They went 31-7. to seven. Right. Well, you know, along that, I mean, the cut of Kruger, <clears throat> regardless of what you, what, you, what you thought that way um, and where he was showing, but you've had a lot of veterans that have been gone now. Oh, and sure. We were talking about Carlos Dansby, who probably... Well, Carlos Dansby is a good player, right. and he's going to play well for Cincinnati. Right. I wouldn't be surprised if Bill Belichick finds something to do with, with Mingo. Mingo, sure. You know, not that he'd be great, but he'll find sure. something to do with him. Kruger may right. jump on somewhere and get some use. But look, they've made no pretense about what they're doing. In other words, they're not, no deception. Yeah, Sashi Brown goes, I would disappoint if he went four wins. What are you supposed to say? Our goal is four. Right. But... It's, this is like the Cavs after LeBron, you know, the equivalent of getting ping pong balls as picks. Sure. Let's play all these young guys. We're going to take the hit. You know, the question will be, number one, can the owner handle it? Can the fans handle it? And will they give it time for um, this to uh, take place to see if they're right on some of these young guys? But I'll tell you this, we're going to see a lot of young players playing. Worst Browns team ever? That's really hard. There's been some really bad ones. <laughs> I don't know how low that, that bar could go without just landing and breaking your toes, but you know, it could be down there this year.